Welcome to another Chaotic Classroom clip. This clip is aimed at Grade 12 learners making use of the CAPS syllabus. Today we're going to discuss the difference between external and internal fertilization. Now before we discuss the differences between the two types of fertilization, it's important to remember that fertilization is the fusion of two gametes, like a sperm cell and an egg cell. Now external fertilization occurs outside of the body of the female and it's going to need water so water is a requirement and what's going to happen is that the sperm cells are released directly into the water and they fuse with the egg cell outside of the female's body and because water is a requirement most of the examples will be aquatic species like frogs fish and jellyfish internal fertilization on the other hand occurs inside of the body of the female and it's not going to need any water so water is not required at all so the sperm cells of the male is going to be transferred into the female by sexual intercourse internal fertilization on the other hand occurs inside of the body of the female and water is not a requirement so you're going to see now with our examples that it's going to be a lot of our non-aquatic animals, our terrestrial animals. Now the sperm cells of the male is going to be transferred into the female by sexual intercourse and it's going to fuse with the ovum inside the female. And our examples here include land animals like birds, most mammals and even insects. And that's it for the day. Thank you for visiting.